everybody, we're playing Dying Light 2. We've just finished the Markers of Blake. Got a new story quest, The Only Way Out. Let's take the zip line. So we've got to make our way over to the bazaar. Stay on the rooftops, as I was told. I wonder what Keep the hell the is going on in the central loop since PK's restricted access. Some say the renegades are about to attack. Aiden, do me a favor and climb up there. We need the windmill back on. He wants me to fix the windmill. Okay, going to the bazaar at the moment. Space down to do the long jump. Trees are growing on top of the buildings. <laughs> okay, it's over here. Word on the rooftops is that water stops are almost depleted. Got a bad season coming. Jump onto that uh, mattress down there. Okay, so the entrance is just there. Oh, that was a bad choice. <laughs> Here's the door. Back off, kid. In we go. Oh, they're out of water. Looks like everybody's out of water. So now we have to meet everybody inside the bazaar. There'll be traders and merchants in here. <laughs> hey, watch where you're going. What a day. No frigging way I can do it. Let's do this guy. And I'll for nothing for I just have to have get easy. it right this time. Easy enough. Alberto needs to see I'm good enough to name out. Basco. What's your problem? Hey, aren't you the pilgrim they wanted to hang? Man, you were in luck there. I could use some of that luck. I'm Alberto's apprentice. Not for long, probably. It's the third time I'm taking a shot at this test. If I fail again, Craftmaster Alberto's gonna kick me out. What's this test about? What's this test about? I have to design something useful for the citizens. I already invented underwater reading glasses for Alberto, then a retractable dog leash, but it kept jamming. And besides, <laughs> we have no dogs here. All my ideas are worthless. Now is my last chance to prove that I am not worthless. So I spent the last several weeks walking around the bazaar and thinking, thinking hard. And then, I hit it! Our goats! They're kept in cages because they eat crops. But life in cages makes them sad, and they give less <laughs> milk. So I came up with the idea of a fence. 
energized with just a tiny bit of voltage. That would keep the goats under control, but let them produce more milk. I call this invention the electric fence. <laughs> Great idea. So what's your problem? We don't want sad goats. So what seems to be the problem with this invention of yours? I'm missing a few parts, and they're not that easy to get. I'm worried I won't be ready on time. Maybe you could help me. If you find them for me, I'll give you one of my super cool inventions. Nothing to do with goats, I hope. Nah, something much more interesting. You'll see. I just need some electric parts. I'll dismantle them for resistors and other useful things. As far as I know, they could be found in two places. One's an old hardware store on Fitzwilliam Place, near the water tower. Alberto says they'll be there for sure. But it's a dark place, full of turned creatures. You have to go there at night. And the other option? Whatever's left of military patrols. I know of one place south of Horseshoe, near the old electrical substation. Bandits roam in the area, so it's possible there's nothing left there. In which case you'll have to look for other patrol remains, or take a night trip to the store. Yeah, I'll see what I can do, but I, I can't promise anything. I would be very grateful. Mm, okay, spark of invention. Some night trips, that sounds interesting. <laughs> Full of zombies. Else we can talk to. Hey, 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 hey. Come on, watch them military restrictions last night. Know anything about it, Aiden? Something you like in the bazaar? That's who I am. Barney said it. The bartender? Hey, hangman. How's the neck? Very funny. Very funny. Let me tell you something. If I were you, then I'd have wished for them to end me. Would you rather have needless deaths on your conscience? I wish you didn't hang the innocent here. Well, it all worked out, didn't it, Pilgrim? You didn't kill anyone, and you're free. Win-win. Who is Barney? Who is Barney? Everyone knows Barney here. I don't. Tell me. Well, I wouldn't bother yourself about Barney. He doesn't like nosy people. Liable to piss him off if he finds out. And you don't want that kind of trouble. No, I definitely want to know more. Okay. He's Sophie's younger brother. Some say he's crazy, but he's a pillar of the bazaar. The PKs are afraid of him, and they should be. Barney is no one to fuck with. Okay. Hey, back off! Who else can we talk to? Someone? Don't recognize me? Or are you allergic to making money? Listen, Pilgrim. We can make a killing, you and me. You just need to get me some beets, radishes, parsnips. There he is. Grab him, Ed. He's a murderer. What? Truly. Luke's been poisoned. From the water you sold him, Devin says. What? But... I don't sell water. Liar. Luke told me he got it from you. Whatever's in it has him ranting and raving now. You're sure he didn't blame me after he started ranting? What's your proof? Oh, well, wait a minute. Do you have proof? Of course. The water came in a bottle. Luke got that water in one of your bottles. When I tell Carl about this, you'll hang! Bevan, wait! I swear, I don't even sell water, damn it! If you're lying, Julian, you're fucking toast. Infected got him. Serves him right, you asked me. Wait, so then, if you're not selling water, how'd someone get a hold of one of your bottles? Knowing that shithead Luke, he probably stole it. That would be like him. Even if he did, my water's pure as melted snowflakes. <laughs> Maybe this is revenge? So... Uh... Maybe it's revenge. For what? Everyone loves me. Never had an enemy in my life. Wait a second. Wait. Shit. Except maybe Marco. That bastard. Come to think of it, he's got an axe to grind for me. It was a long time ago. Never mind. Listen. 
He lives above an old shop on the west end of Villador, on Houndfield Lane. I traded him a few kilos of my finest flour for the water. Prove he poisoned it, and half my flour is yours. Can you do that for me? I guess I could check it out. And there's one more thing. I'm a little embarrassed. Hans might also have a bottle of this water. I thought you weren't selling it. I'm not, except, well, to Hans and... Can you go warn him? He's also on Hanfield, a few buildings down. Something's fishy about this, Julian. Look, you better be telling the truth, otherwise it'll be hard to help you. <laughs> sus. He's very sus. Man, I'm so thirsty. Okay, new side quest. Cheers. Hey, this that's guy. the pilgrim. Yeah, pilgrim, aren't you? That's right. Do you hang people for that too? Uh, I just wanted to say that I was rooting for you. Yeah, uh huh. Thanks for standing up for me. What? But I, I didn't. Ah, I get it. Sarcasm. Look, it's not that easy to go against the crowd. Sure. I know people are scared of pilgrims sometimes, but... <sighs> Shit. You survived outside the walls. <laughs> that to be some. So we got I craft and try to over here. Holy the finest. Craftmasters. Craftmasters allow you to buy and upgrade blueprints. Upgrading blueprints makes the items you create from them more powerful. To upgrade a blueprint, bring the required items to a craftmaster and exchange them for a blueprint upgrade. Items used for blueprint upgrades can be looted from special infected, which are easier to find at night and marked on your map with a blue icon. Alright, cool. Craftmaster. So we've got a UV bar with a 4 meter radius. So 280 gold coins. Endurance booster. Fire arrows. Can't afford any of those right now. Okay, what about the upgrades? I can upgrade my medicine. So I need five infected trophies. So I've got four, so I just need one more of those. Makes it quicker to apply. I can also upgrade the lockpick. And throwing knife. So I need more of those infected trophies. And I can buy craft parts here as well. Scraps. I can use scraps for lockpicks. Another satisfied customer. <laughs> <coughs> okay. I'll let this guy over here. Okay, what's it gonna flip? Merchants. Merchants allow you to buy craft parts, new weapons, and other items as well as sell valuables and unwanted loot that you collect. They offer the most powerful weapons, so visit them often and increase your combat strength. You can find merchants in all the main hubs, as well as inside the facilities and settlements. Cool. What's he got? 28. A thingamabob. 20. We can sell weapons here too. Don't get much for them though. Hmm. Warsaw. Loose screw. So the thing in my bob's probably the best weapon there. Remote C4. Explosion radius 5 meters, 67 damage. Okay, we've got fighter mitts, it's obviously armor. We've got a hat or headgear, and torso armor. Torso add ons. So we can buy lots of armor here, and some materials. So 
definitely come back here later when I've got some more coins. Hello? Hello? No, they're not talking. Got a gig as a finisher tomorrow. Someone's got to take care of the biters roaming the streets around the bazaar at dawn. These guys won't talk. Elgrim, take my advice. Leave this city before you get trapped here for good. Psst. You. Got water for sale? I'll pay half a crystal per gallon. A little space, please? It's back here. The sick people. That's about the only time I smile. Oh, then Corona, I let's get out of here. UV lights. <laughs> <laughs> the exit. We're going upstairs here. Through the door. Is the dark zone necessary? A little you space, promised. please. Guess I shouldn't make promises when I. Okay, here's a rest stop where we can have a sleep. And we got goats. They must be the sad goats. And the player stash, so we can put some of this stuff away. Get rid of some of the white junk. <coughs> Not talking. <coughs> no. Finally found a great place to live. Right above Five the years of learning. You look familiar. Yeah. I'm the guy who almost got hanged. Why worry? You're standing here, aren't you? Excuse me? Look, we had no choice. If you had turned like we thought you were gonna, it would have been a massacre. Yeah, you're right. I see. It was a risky situation. I get it. So? We good? We're good. Okay. So I think we've actually met everybody in the bazaar now. I don't think there's anybody else around here. Psst, you. Got water for sale? I'll pay half a crystal to get <laughs> Everybody wants water. <laughs> so that's the end of this episode, guys. Thanks for watching. Click like and subscribe to see more in the Dying Light 2 story series. And uh, we'll see you next time. Bye for now. Five years of learning and all for nothing. I just have to get it right this time. Alberto.